Can murder ever really be funny? Believe it or not, on Broadway, sure. In fact, it can even be set to music. Uh, Gentleman's Guide to Love and Murder is this year's Tony Award winner for Best Musical. So how can a serial killer be slightly innocent and ultimately endearing? <laughs> Here's ABC's Lifestyle Editor, Genevieve Shaw-Brown. It's not very often that an audience falls in love with a serial killer, but that's exactly what happens at the Broadway hit, A Gentleman's Guide to Love and Murder. If this show's gonna work, it has to, you have to like the main character, it's his story. What I came up with was bring them along for the ride, sort of on his side, the underdog. If you've ever been told you can't, you know, you're on Monty's side. I am the next Earl of Highhurst. Penniless Monty Navarro, played by Bryce Pinkham, loses his beloved mother and finds out the family secret. He's an heir to a fortune and just eight people and murders stand between him and riches and revenge. The Tony Award winner for Best Musical's Murder's Plot is filled with not horror, but laughter. And much of that laughter comes from the show's other star. Oh, I don't understand the poor. I don't know, I'm kind of playing every role that I've ever wanted to play in my life in this one play. Playing every member of the family that needs to be eliminated for Monty to realize his dreams, from an elderly reverend who falls to his death, to a middle-aged philanthropist who survives a tribe of cannibals, but not Monty. The role is intensely physical, with frantic costume changes taking place in seconds just off stage. Slap on a mustache, rip off a wig, put on a new hat, put gloves on me, hand me a prop, and push me bodily back on stage after squirting water in my mouth. <laughs> Every night's a crazy night because these changes are finished just in the nick of time when I have to uh, go on to the next scene. Knock on wood, miraculously enough, nothing devastating has happened. Gentlemen, have secrets in my the, the scenes that I look forward to with Bryce are the quiet scenes, and he's sort of a humane, almost a fatherly figure. It's just nice to sit and talk to Bryce and not have to sing and dance, you know, just for a few seconds. But is Monty a loyal son, revenging his mother's death, or a shameless social climber? Turns out, it's both. First 20 minutes of the show are like the rules of the game are being placed, and then once you start playing, it gets to be really fun. That first murder is sort of like when the the cork is popped. I just love that when the audience goes, oh, now we get the game. Genevieve Shaw Brown, ABC News, New York. I would love to go see that. We, we should go. We should go. We, we, should a take, we should take a World News Now field trip. That Let's sounds go great. Some. Go see. I haven't actually seen any theater in the past year that I've been here in New York. There we go. Right? It's done. Let's okay. go see something murderous and hilarious. <laughs>